good atmosphere around like the bar and it just makes like working a bit more fun yeah. as fun as it can be so we don't really get much of a break so constant Carl and Co is Moretti Carl and Co is Moretti constantly for the full build up of the match and then after the match if we've won you see a lot more people coming back if we've lost you don't see as many but still quite a few people I've like always known about Sunderland Football Club and um, so I've known they've been like big like supporters like all the fans in the city um, so when I moved up here I was expecting like a lot of like fans to be out on match days and then when I started going out I was like a bit taken back of how many fans actually did go out and like how much everyone got into it. around the football club. Um, without the football club, what else have we got? So no matter what, we would we support the club. We bred into everyone from a young age in this city, um, and it's in your blood. I think specifically Port of Call and a lot of the town as well. It just there's a feeling of everyone's in the same boat. So I mean, you could be sat in the house watching it, and you might celebrate on the set by yourself where you could be in the pub and it's no better feeling because you can have a drink, you can have a pint with, them, with your mates or people you don't even know who support someone and there's, there's just that group feeling of no matter what, everyone's sort of in it together. Because you've got that mutual connection of loving someone and going to matches, you make friends for life or going to like away games and stuff. There's a lot of my friends who, if it wasn't for Sunderland Football Club, I would probably never, I wouldn't know them. It's just a community spirit of togetherness. It's the one thing that this city struggles with, I think, but the club, is the thing that brings people together. Go on, 